what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here i apologize that i haven't uploaded in a while i just started a new job dealing with auto and home insurance uh so i had to get my license and pass the state exam which i did so now that that's over i will be uploading more frequently but just hopping right into it uh we got our first look at charles cyphers who i made a video about few weeks ago potentially returning the sheriff bracket we got our first image of him on set of halloween kill so it appears he is indeed back uh also we got breaking news a few days ago that the movie would be returning to haddonfield memorial now i want to stop there and just get into what my whole point of this video is i've seen a lot of news articles and just a lot of things making this news apparent and then what's happening is people are seeing a headline and they're running and saying oh Halloween Halloween kills is going to take place at Haddonfield Memorial that's not that's not what that means the movie very well could take place at Haddonfield Memorial yes but just because it's going to have Haddonfield Memorial in the movie doesn't mean that it's going to be doing exactly what Halloween 2 from 1981 did it just does not mean that the movie could just have the, the the hospital in there for like a few scenes and then that's it or we could just be flopping back and forth from the hospital to the streets of Haddonfield to see what Michael is doing and then maybe at the end he makes his way into the hospital uh so I don't think I don't think the, the majority of the film is going to take place inside that hospital that's just me I think that's where our movie is going to start and then from there we'll go back into the streets of Haddonfield and also it does look like Halloween Kills will be picking up from where the end of the 2018 film left off because the first few images started coming off of Jamie Lee Curtis and it looks like they are going to be shooting scenes of them at least getting off of the truck so with that in mind I, I have to ask the question are we just going to see what's happening at the beginning is it going to have a time jump or are we going to literally pick up and go from there so if we're going to be picking up from it I hope that's where we stay I hope we don't pick up and then jump years later I don't I hope we don't do that um but I'm glad they're going back to Haddonfield Memorial. I kind of expected that. I know Dave McRae himself, he made a video a few months ago making mention of a potential scene with uh, Haddonfield Memorial. Me personally, I'd like to see the entire franchise wrap up with Halloween Ends being uh, some type of final showdown has to happen at the Myers house because I feel like we haven't seen the Myers house for a reason. I wonder if they have something big planned and that's what the ultimate plan is to end all of this in the Myers house. But of course, we'll find that out in the coming weeks when production finish rap, finishes wrapping and we get our first look at the film. We start getting ex specific specifics in regards to the plot more information in regards to what the characters are going to be doing because right now halloween kills looks like a bigger reunion than uh the last movie and on top of that now michael myers is no longer the only senior citizen in the film uh if you don't understand what i'm saying or what i mean by that then in the last movie michael myers is like 60 years old and a lot of people are making fun of him calling him old man myers and how unrealistic it was that he was still doing it but whatever the fact that they're going back to Haddonfield Memorial, I expect they're going to use this to kind of uh, pay homage to the original second film from 1981. Uh, also, on top of this, I kind of feel like we're going to run into Tommy Doyle, who is a doctor there. I think that's what Tommy Doyle is going to be. I think he's going to function as a doctor at Haddonfield Memorial. Uh, the picture of Sheriff Brackett that you saw a few moments ago, it looks like he's going to be a security guard of sorts. He, of course, he's no longer a sheriff. Uh, stepped down but hasn't retired completely so it looks like he's like on on duty at Haddonfield Memorial um I don't think we're gonna I and on top of that there's a have there's been like flashbacks or stuff is coming out stuff's coming about it's coming out about this film left and right stuff regarding a flashback between Lonnie Elam Lonnie Elam and Michael Myers uh, potential chase scene that we didn't see in the original film they're going to be a flashback to 1978 which i'm perfectly fine with anything that just does not change the ending i'm fine with or adds too much uh too much more to the narrative i'm fine
is his purpose going to be? Or are we just bringing these characters back to bring them back? Uh, what do you guys think about them going back to Haddonfield Memorial? Let me know down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed, turn on post notifications so you never miss a video.